empty the contents of a urinary drainage bag and measure and record the results on the intake output form. Good morning, Mrs. Jones. My name is Sharon and I'm your NA for today. I'm here to empty your urinary drainage bag. Is now a good time. All right, I'm going to go gather my supplies, wash my hands, and I'll be right back. I'll pull this curtain shut to provide for your safety, your privacy. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to come over here and I'm going to wash my hands for at least 20 seconds. And then I'm going to put on my gloves. Take a paper towel for a barrier. And the graduate container is in the bottom drawer. Set this on the floor. I'm going to open the clamp and then point it in and drain all of the urine in the bag. Close the clamp and make sure you put it back in its little pocket. All right, now I'm going to take the barrier and the container over to the windowsill, which is the bathroom, set it down, and look close at it in a flat surface. Okay, I have 75 milliliters in there. You're going to record only in milliliters. I'm going to dump it into the toilet, take my barrier to the sink. Put a tiny bit of water in it, swirl it around, take it back to the toilet, dump it in, use my barrier, and dry out my container. I'm going to put my container back in the bottom drawer. <clears throat> all right, Mrs. Jones, I'm all done. Here's your call light. Call me if you need anything. Come back over to the sink. Make sure I take my gloves off in the proper way. Throw them away. I would wash my hands for at least 20 seconds. And then I will record my intake and output. It's going to be the time is 1.25. I emptied urine. I had 75 milliliters and my initials and sign my name. Most important is don't you must record after you've already washed your hands and taken your gloves off. All right, I'm going to step outside the room, turn back and look, make sure I did everything I did. So now I say done. <laughs>